Welcome to Daddy Curb's Orchard. I wanted to give you a view on this beautiful morning. The sun is out. Luke is in the orchard hanging out with his dog and his goose. That's right, we have a new goose. That goose's name is April, and April loves Luke. April does not care much for others so far, but she has taken to Luke. My orchard is coming out beautifully. Everything is coming out with leaves and flowers. These are the two young plum trees that I just planted this year. And they are full of leaves. This apple back here is the one that I planted in the video. And it's looking very nice. I'll give you a close up of that. This is a close-up of the uh, gala apple tree that I just planted this year. You can see it's looking nice. Got leaves coming out on the on the trunk. The branches and leaves, they all look just right. The right color, the right size coming out. And I also want to point out in the orchard that I put comfrey on the front side, actually on, only on the south side of each mound of the new mounds. On the existing mounds, I did it on, on the first six mounds I should say, I did it on the north and south. Uh, some of them, the ones on the, on the north, it's not much of a slope but it's just a tiny little bit. The ones on the north sides, let me show you over here. Maybe it's shade and not slope, I'm not sure, but uh, the ones on the north sides of the trees have not produced as fully as on the south. And that probably has a lot to do with the angle of the sun in the mornings and not necessarily the angle of or the slope of the, the little mounds. This, one, this one's more even. That one's a, a, a little uneven, north being smaller than the south. Over here, both died, and the same on that one. They, the, those are the only two mounds where the comfrey did not uh, live. So, but on this one, I actually took the, the one over here out, and I divided the roots to plant on all of these over here. So I had enough roots to, to start, uh, what is that? Uh, eight, eight new little comfrey plants and it was really easy to transplant and it all looks about like that now and it's only on the south sides of these new trees so this is the plum both trees look like this very full coming out very nice they love love their new home This is the apple tree that I I broke when I was trying to hang some weights from the branches, but it's mending up beautifully. I tied it up and everything is leafing out and looking good. So that one I, I believe is safe and healthy. And my pear trees are finally coming out with leaves and looking beautiful. I was worried about them for a little while because they weren't doing anything. So that, that's the uh, one of the oriental pears. I believe I have three oriental pears and one kefir pear. This is uh, one of my peach trees. And you can see young peaches coming on there. Now the peach tree that had the split personality, you can see the other side. This was the side that had only flowers and this was all the leaves. Well this one's getting leaves now so I'm not so concerned. It's just a little later. This is another oriental pear. I believe it's a different variety. Uh, Asian pear I guess. Uh, another, a different variety but it's still an Asian pear. Lots of leaves. I'll, I'll trim that up later this year when the leaves fall off. 
figure out which branches I want to keep. But this year, I, for this growing season, I'm just going to let it grow out. Let it put some energy down into the roots. And these are the first six of the orchard. The two nectarine, those are the ones that froze this year. I will not be getting fruit. And this is my kefir pear, and that's my first Asian pear. This kefir pear, I heard someone say that kefir pears will not produce fruit unless they are with another kefir. But, I have little fruit. So, either that's not true, or these fruit are not going to uh, mature. I'm not sure. We'll see what happens this year. So, and that's the, uh, the biggest Asian pear right now. The branches are, have been weighted systematically to help pull them out to be more horizontal instead of straight up. And that's working out pretty nicely. And then my two, this is I believe a golden dorset apple and lots of nice blossoms on there. That's looking very nice. So there's a view, that's a walkthrough of my orchard on this beautiful sunny morning. Does it feel good out here, Luke? Yes. Do you like the orchard? Yes. I just got a bit on the ankle. Hey, April. Hey, April. How are you?